Inventor 2013 now lets us create equation curves. Equation curves are useful for designing complex geometry, for example, airplane wings or airplane ailerons. Equation curves can be created for 2D and 3D sketches. Right now, I'm in a 2D sketch. And in a 2D sketch, we can create an explicit or a parametric equation. Let's begin with an explicit equation. Let's say x equals 1. For example, from minus 10 to plus 10. Another example would be x minus 1. Let's try a parametric example now. In order to save time, I'm going to paste my trigonometric functions from another document here. Now for the y of theta. The t maximum will be 180 to minus 180. OK, with my equations pasted, let me actually change some parameters. Let's change this to 3 times the cosine of theta and the y value to 6 times. And let's click Accept. OK, let's go to the 3D sketch environment. Here we've got three options, Cartesian, cylindrical, and third is spherical. OK, let's input some minimum and maximum values for t, let's say minus 30, and plus 30. Let's type in t here. And you can see the preview in the graphic area. t to the power of 2 multiplied by 10. And let's take a step in that direction. Let's say t plus 1. And here is our helix. So a very quick way to create pretty complicated geometry. This concludes our overview of equation curves in Inventor 2013.